This problem is from complex integration. Now we have to evaluate integral x minus 2y dx plus y square minus x square dy where c is the boundary of the first quadrant of the circle x square plus y square is equal to 4. See here in the solution what is given. So it is a circle equation in the first quadrant that is x square plus y square is equal to 4. Now the parametric equations of the circle can be written as x is equal to this is 2 cos theta where 2 is the radius and y is equal to this is 2 sin theta. Now, our derivative will be dx is equal to, see here, dx is equal to, for cos theta, the derivative is 2 sin theta into d theta. And dy is equal to, this is 2 cos theta into t theta. I got all the four values and now using this, I am going to evaluate the integral. So, what is the integral here? Integral is nothing but x minus 2y into dx plus this is y square minus x square into dy where theta value ranges from 0 to pi by 2. Now I am going to substitute all the values here. So after substitution see here in place of x I am going to write 2 cos theta. So this is 2 into cos theta minus 2 times of what is y? y is nothing but this is 2 sin theta into dx. What is dx? This is minus 2 sin theta into d theta plus the next value here is y square. So, what is y square? y square is nothing but 4 sin square theta minus x square. So, this is 4 cos square theta into dy. dy is nothing but 2 cos theta into d theta. Now, if I multiply, so the theta value ranges from 0 to pi by 2 here, pi by 2. Now, I am going to multiply each and every term. See here, if I multiply, so this is 2 cos theta minus 2 to the 4 sin theta into, so this is minus 2 sin theta into d theta. The next thing here is, so this is 4 sin square theta minus this is 4 cos square theta into this value is 4 cos theta into d theta. So, if I multiply, see here, theta value ranges from 0 to pi by 2. Now, if I multiply each and every term here, then if I multiply this is 2 into 2, 4. This is minus 4 times of this value is sin theta into cos theta into d theta. If I multiply these two, minus 4 into minus 2. So, this is plus 8 sin theta into sin theta is nothing but sin square theta into d theta. So, if I multiply these two, this will be 4, 2, 0, 8. This value is a sin square theta into this value is cos theta. If I multiply these two, this will be 4, 2, 0, 8. Cos square theta into cos theta is nothing but cos cube theta into d theta between the limits 0 to, this is 0 to pi by 2. Now, see here I am going to use some formula here. So, in order to use some formula, see let me tell you, this is integral 0 to pi by 2. This can be written as, so this can be written as, I am taking minus 2 common. So, this will be 2 sin theta into cos theta into d theta and this is nothing but 8 times of so this value is sin square theta into d theta and see here this value is nothing but plus 8 times of this is sin square theta into this value is cos theta minus 8 times of cos cube theta into d theta now i am going to split each and every integral this is from 0 to pi by 2 and this is from 0 to pi by 2 and this is from 0 to pi by 2. So, from intermediate, I am going to use certain formulae. As you know that, see here. So, in place of 2 sin theta into cos theta, I can write as sin 2 theta. So, this is the formula I am going to use. See here, in place of 2 sin theta into cos theta, I am going to use sin 2 theta and here, in place of sin square theta, I am going to use 1 minus cos 2 theta by 2. And the next thing here is in place of cos cube theta. 
from intermediate we have cos 3 theta is equal to 4 cos cube theta minus 3 cos theta and I want this cos cube theta. So, I am sending minus 3 cos theta to other side. So, 4 cos cube theta is equal to cos 3 theta plus 3 cos theta and cos cube theta is equal to cos 3 theta plus 3 cos theta by 4. I am going to use all these formulae that is cos cube theta cos square theta and 2 sin theta cos theta in my next step. See here. So, if I substitute all these formulae here, then see what happens. So, this will be 0 to pi by 2 minus 2 times of 2 sin theta cos theta is nothing but sin 2 theta. So, I am writing sin 2 theta into d theta plus this is 8 times of 0 to pi by 2. 0 to pi by 2 sin square theta can be written as 1 minus cos 2 theta by 2. So, this can be written as 1 minus cos 2 theta by 2 into d theta and see here. So, this is as usual 0 to pi by 2. This is 8 sin square theta into cos theta into d theta minus 8 times of this is 0 to pi by 2 cos cube theta can be written as cos cube theta can be written as cos 3 theta plus 3 cos theta by 4. So, this can be written as cos 3 theta plus 3 cos theta by 4 into d theta into d theta. Now, I am going to calculate each and every value of this. See here. So, this will be integral 0 to pi by 2. So, the next step here is integral 0 to pi by 2 minus 2 times of sin 2 theta into d theta. It is clear. And if I cancel these two or bring this one 8 by 2 times of this is 0 to pi by 2. This is 1 minus cos 2 theta into d theta. And see here if I consider sin t as uh, sin t sin theta is equal to t sin theta is equal to t then cos theta into d theta is nothing but dt see then this value will be see here this value will be see if theta is equal to 0 sin 0 is 0 if theta is equal to pi by 2 sin 90 degrees is 1 so this is 8 times of sin theta is nothing but t t square cos theta d theta is nothing but dt so, I am going to solve like this and this value is equal to this is 8 by 4 times of integral 0 to pi by 2. This is cos 3 theta plus this is cos theta into d theta. See here. So, this is minus 2 times of for cos 2 theta the value here is minus cos 2 theta by 2 between the limits. See here between the limits 0 to pi by 2 and the next one here is this value is nothing but 8 by 2 times of 8 by 2 times of for 1 into d theta the value here is theta and again for sin 2 theta the value is sin for cos 2 theta the integration is sin 2 theta by 2 between the limits so between the limits 0 to pi by 2 again this is 0 to this is pi by 2 and the next thing here is this value is 8 times of. So, this value is nothing but 8 times of. So, for t square the integration part is nothing but t cube by 3 between the limits 0 to 1. So, this is 0 to 1 and the next thing here is minus 8 by 4 times of minus 8 by 4 times of for cos 3 theta the value here is for cos 3 theta the value here is sin 3 theta by 3 and for this one 3 times of for cos theta the integration is sin theta between the limits 0 to so the, between the limits 0 to pi by 2 so got it so is it not clear so first of all see here so I use this <coughs> formulae in place of 2 sin theta cos theta I wrote sin 2 theta in place of sin square theta I wrote 1 minus cos 2 theta by 2 and I left this as it is and uh, for cos cube theta I wrote cos 3 theta plus 3 cos theta by 4 and uh, so 
this is minus 2 times of this is sin 2 theta and this 8 by 2 times of 1 minus cos 2 theta by 2. So, in this place, in place of sin theta, I wrote t and this will be dt. And here for cos 3 theta, the value here is, this is cos 3 theta plus 3 cos theta by 4. And now I have to use the integration formula. For sin 2 theta, the value here is minus cos 2 theta by 2 between the limit 0 to pi by 2. And for 1 d theta, it is nothing but theta. For cos 2 theta, the value here is sin 2 theta by 2. And for t square, the integration is t cube by 3. And for cos 3 theta, this is sin 3 theta by 3. And for cos theta, this is sin theta. Now, I am going to substitute each and every value. See here, upper limit minus lower limit. So, this will be 2 times of minus cos 2 into this value is pi by 2 and I am sending this 2 outside minus minus of minus this value is plus so this is cos 0 so the lower limit is cos 0 this is 8 by 2 times of if you observe this one so this value is pi by 2 minus a sign 2 into this value is pi by 2 by 2 and the next thing here is this value is 8, this is 1 by 3 and this value if I cancel it for 2 times, so this will be sine of, this is 3 into pi by 2, pi by 2 divided by 3 plus 3 into sine pi by 2, we have all the values here. So, if I cancel this 2, then this will be cos pi. As you know that cos pi value is nothing but, see here, cos pi value is nothing but minus 1. Cos 0 value, cos 0. So, this is cos 0 value is plus 1. Sin 90 degrees, pi by 2 value is 1. And sin 3 into 90, 270 value is nothing but this is minus 1. I'll show you how. So, this is sin 3 into pi by 2 is nothing but 270. It can be written as sin of 360 minus 90. This is minus sin 90 which is equal to minus 1. So, these are the values needed to solve this. So, this is going to become minus 1. So, this is minus 1 times of cos pi value is minus 1. This is minus of minus plus 1 plus cos 0 value is 1. And see, this is 8 by 2 by 8 that is 4 times of this is pi by 2 and if I cancel this sin pi value is 0. See here sin n pi value will be 0. So, sin pi value will be 0. So, this value is going to become 0. So, this is minus 0 and this is 8 by 3 minus 2 times of. So, 3 into pi by 2, 3 into pi by 2 is 270. This value is minus 1 by 3 and this value is plus 3. So, this value is plus 3. See here, so this is going to become, this is 2 and if I cancel this for 2 times, this is 2 pi plus this value is 8 by 3. If I multiply, so this is going to become 2 by 3. This is plus 2 by 3 and this is minus 6. And see this value is 2 pi plus this value is 8 by 3 plus 2 by 3 minus 6 and this is minus 2. And see this is uh, 2 pi. So this value is 2 pi plus if I take 3 LCM this will be 8 plus 2 minus 18 minus 6. See this is minus 10 minus 16 plus 2. So, the value here is 2 pi minus 14 by 3. So, this is the value. See here, this is 10 minus 8 minus 8 minus 6. This is minus 14 by 3. So, this is how we have to solve. And see here, let me explain you once again. See, this is the complex integral which we have to evaluate using the boundary of the first quadrant of the circle x square plus y square is equal to 4. So, we have to take the parametric equations as x is equal to 2 cos theta, y is equal to 2 sin theta. So, this is dx and this is dy. 
all the values are ready here so we have to transform into line integral so i'm just transforming it in terms of theta so in place of x i wrote this one in place of y in place of y as 2 sin theta in place of dy as 2 cos theta into d theta and here the limits are from 0 to pi by 2 and after multiplying so i got this so i have to use this formula in place of 2 sin theta cos theta see here in place of uh, 2 sin theta cos theta i wrote sin 2 theta and in place of sin square theta i wrote 1 minus uh, 1 minus cos 2 theta by 2 and again in place of cos cube theta i wrote as cos uh, 3 theta plus 3 cos theta by 4 and after substituting all the values here all the values here so in this third integral i have to write uh, sin theta as t and cos theta into d theta will be dt so here the limits will be changing from 0 to 1 so after transforming in terms of uh, the relevant uh, formulae so i have to integrate for cos 2 theta the value here is minus cos 2 theta by 2 and here for t 1 it is theta for cos 2 theta it is sin 2 theta by 2 and here for t square this will be t cube by 3 and for cos 3 theta this is sin 3 theta by 3 and for cos theta is again cos theta between the limits and after substituting each and every limit so these are the values required we know that cos 180 is minus 1 cos 0 is 1 sin 90 is 1 sin 3 into pi by 2 that is 270 is minus 1 and sin pi is uh, 0 after substituting all the values we got the final answer as 2 pi minus 14 by 3 and this is how we have to solve please practice definitely you can solve your solve by your own please pass it on to your friends and subscribe to this channel and i'll be uploading many many problems related to this series have a look at those two thank you so much